evening, our first order of uh, business is uh, going to be a presentation uh, to or for the uh, Historic Preservation uh, Month, actually. Uh, this is um, a proclamation that I would like to make, so I will at this point go to the podium and ask our chair of the Historic Preservation Society to join me, Peter. Yeah. See you this evening. Yes, you do. Uh, this reads, Proclamation for Preservation Month. Whereas the historic preservation is an effective tool for managing growth and sustainable development, revitalizing neighborhoods, fostering local pride, and maintaining community character while enhancing livability, and whereas historic preservation is relevant for communities across the nation, both urban and rural, for Americans of all ages, all walks of life, and all ethnic backgrounds. And whereas it is important to celebrate the role of history in our lives and the contributions made by dedicated individuals in helping to preserve the tangible aspects of the heritage that has shaped us as a people. And whereas people saving places is the theme of National Preservation Month 2022 co-sponsored by the Village Historic Preservation Commission and the National Trust for Historic Preservation. And therefore, resolved that I, Darrell Byers, Mayor of the Village of Webster and the Webster Village Board of Trustees, do recognize May 20, uh, 2022 as National Preservation Month and call upon the people of the Village of Webster to join their fellow citizens across the United States in recognizing and participating in this special observance. Well, Peter, I will give this to you, but um, thank you, we'll Kathy. post it up in the right. village office. All right, thank you very much. Uh, sure, yeah. I, wanna, I just want to thank the village board for their continued support throughout the years. Um, a, lot of, a lot of communities do not have historic preservation commissions, so there aren't any one, there aren't any ones looking out for the historic properties in the village. And we have a not a mandatory type of commission, but rather one that can just do recommendations and can continuously look at um, the historic structures in the village. And there are many, and there are many beautiful buildings, um, and they've got a great stories um, in our village. So, um, and Jake, you'll appreciate this one. Our, our historic preservation site for this month is the standpipe. I don't know if you saw it down there. So there will be an article in the paper about the standpipe and about its history, how it was built. Uh, we consulted with the uh, village uh, historian, Lynn Barton, and she found some great pictures of it even being constructed. Things we never even knew that were, at least I didn't even know that were there, like holding tanks were actually there. So um, it is a, it's a great history, and we wanted to make sure we recognize that as we go through the summer. Uh, we will be recognizing one property every month until we get into October um, for some, something special about that property. Um, so look for our sign. Right now it's on South Avenue right near the water tower. Um, but, uh, but that is a great history. And look for the look at the Webster Herald next week to uh, just see a little bit more about it. So, thank you. Thank you. Would the board like to come up and get a picture? Oh. Do you want to hold that? Oh, sure. Sure. Come on. I'll sit Julie. Here, I'll sit Julie. Get your shoes on. Get the slippers on. Okay. Get the slippers on. Thank you. 